Hello YouTube, today we're doing a quick example in linear algebra on how to um, diagonalize a matrix um, in the form S lambda S inverse. Um, this is called diagonalization. so we're just going to do a nice simple example, pretty short video. So we have a matrix A, uh, 2 by 2, and you're given to write the uh, matrix in that form, S lambda S inverse. So first, like you normally do, you find your eigenvalues, that's your lambda, right? Um, and lambda is the diagonal matrix in this uh, form here, so we're going to have to find the, solve for the eigenvalues. So, um, you know, do your eigenvalue stuff, you know what you're doing. Um, and when you uh, do the determinant, you should get lambda squared minus 2 lambda minus 80 plus 72 equals 0. Simplify that um, factor, and you should get lambda 1 and lambda 2 to be negative 2 and 4. So now you solve for your eigenvectors. So, oh, real quick, yeah, lambda. This is the diagonalization. So you make the main diagonal your eigenvectors and everything else zero. Next, uh, use your first eigenvalue and solve for your eigenvector. Um, so what you do is when you have negative 2, you just plug it into that um, blue part over there on the left. Um, so 10 minus negative 2 is 12. Um, negative 6, 12. Negative 8 minus negative 2 is negative 6. Um, times v1 equals 0, right? So um, you can do this like algebra way, or you can actually row reduce. I'm just going to do it the algebra way, and you should get x2 is equal to 2x1. So uh, you can pick any numbers you want for your special solution here. Um, so I just picked x1 to be 1, and therefore x2 would be 2. Um, then you're going to do the same thing for your next eigenvalue, which is 4. You should get this as your matrix times v2, which is your second eigenvector, is equal to 0. So again, solve for x1 and x2. Um, you should get x1 equals x2, so the simplest uh, solution that I can think of is 1, 1. Um, so now your s, what is your s? Well, it's the combination of s1 and s2. You just put them together, and then you have 1, 2, 1, 1. And now you take the inverse. Oops. Now, shortcut for a 2 by 2 matrix, um, if you have this a inverse, is simply 1 over the determinant times uh, the matrix in this form. So you just swi switch the main diagonal and um, make B and C opposite have opposite signs. So that's what I did here. Um, and then the, the determinant, I believe, was negative 1. So then you have to fix that, too. And then you have every piece you need. S, lambda, which we found, big lambda, which is what we found in the first part. And then you have your S inverse, and you put that all together. You got your S, your lambda, and your S inverse. Now, what's really cool is that since this is equal to A, right? Um, I don't think I wrote that anymore, but yeah, that's what it equals A. Um, so S lambda S inverse is equal to A. So if you multiply all this out, you could get your uh, matrix. So I wanted to do a quick three-minute video. Here it is, and now here's my conclusion. So good luck and happy studying, and keep, keep practicing.